So today is the, the beginning of the third annual Paint Burlingame Day. And what Paint Burlingame is, is it's a one day painting event where people take their canvases and their easels, they pick out a spot in Burlingame, they paint all day long, they come back to the Burlingame Hillsborough History Museum, will display their artwork, will judge their artwork, they'll get fabulous cash prizes and gift certificates, we'll auction off some items, and we'll just have a good time. Having people come out and spending a day focusing on creating something beautiful and then showing it later that day, it's really fun. It's just a fun way of having a little bit of art in the community. And everybody has a balloon in a bag. So the idea is that the community at large sees all these balloons and people painting and wonders what's going on. My son wanted to paint this sign actually because he loves trains and um, I also love to paint so we decided to join this eventful day. I love doing oil paintings and this it's just fun for me. I'm a French student from France and I'm doing a rotation in San Francisco. So as I'm living here in, in Bellingham, I use every day the, the coal train to go to the city. And so uh, maybe it's maybe the place that I know uh, the, the best here in the, in the town. And I found the, the color and the, you know, the architecture of the place very, very nice. My name is Melissa Chamberlain and today I painted this painting. Um, I just like how you could see the railroad and just the perspective of everything. Absolutely, yeah, I look forward to it next year. You know, I like the, it's fun doing plein air events and it's really cool that there's one actually on, I think it's probably the only one on the peninsula. So hopefully the word will get out and there'll be more people, you know, participating. I think it's, uh, you know, it's a fun event and most people, like, when I'm on the street, most of the people coming by are excited by it and, you know, so I think it's a, it's kind of a cool community thing.